welcome to the session. In this session, we'll discuss a question which says that draw the line of reflection symmetry that will carry the following figures onto itself. Now, let us start with the solution of the given question. Now, here we have to draw the line of symmetry for the given figures. Now, we know line of symmetry acts as a mirror line such that one part is the reflection of the other part. Thus, a line of symmetry is a line along which a shape may be folded so that both parts of the shape will match. Now, let us start with the first part. Now, in first part, we have a pentagon. Now, let us draw its line of symmetry. Now, let us label the vertices of this pentagon as A, B, C, D and E. Now, our first line of symmetry will be through the vertex A. Now, here you can see the two parts are a reflection of each other. Similarly, we obtain that the two parts will overlap each other exactly if we fold the figure through vertex B, C, D and E. So, given pentagon has five lines of symmetry. Now, let us start with the second part. Now, in second part, we have alphabet A. Now, if we fold it vertically, then the two parts overlap each other exactly. So, there is one line of symmetry. Now, let us start with the third part. Here we have a triangle. Now, we can fold it in three ways so that one part of triangle is reflection of the other part. Let us name the vertices of this triangle as A, B and C. Now, the first fold is through vertex A and here we have drawn a line through vertex A. And we have two triangles and we can see that Triangle ABD is reflection of triangle ACD. Similarly, the second fold will be through vertex B and third will be through vertex C. So, the given triangle has three lines of symmetry. Now, let us start with the fourth part. Now, in fourth part, we are given a parallelogram. Now, let us see whether it has symmetry or not. Now, when we fold it from center, we have two correlators formed and none is the reflection of other. The two parts do not overlap each other exactly. Similarly, if we fold it from center or diagonally, then also both parts are different. So, the given parallelogram does not have a line of symmetry. So, this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.